Hey guys, welcome back to the Far Side server, and we're here today with my arch nemesis of Redstone on the server. Hello. That he thinks he's as good as me, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> we'll find out eventually. We'll have a contest. We'll have a Redstone War. Yeah. But anyways, what we're going to start off with today is uh, doing some work at this little thing, magnific magnificent thing I have here. I've been told, we're going to turn mob sounds down because they are loud. And uh, we've been told that these prices are really expensive and well, stuff. Well, they've told you. I'm yeah. Part of this. yeah, I've been told that these are expensive. And so I'm going to put these, the iron horse armor down to two diamonds, the saddles down to three, the name tags down to four, and then uh, we don't have any gold or diamond yet horse armor so we'll uh we'll do that once we maybe this is the block yep so we'll do that once that once that time comes um so let's just go ahead and replace these prices real quick so this this will do five so i want this to go down to two so one two three which would be 18 19 20 yep two for that and then 20 so we want this is uh, one, that's five up there right now. One, two, so that's now three. And then if we replace this one back here, wrong one. Replace this one right here. This has cobble, so this is nine currently. So if we put this down to four, we need to add five. One, two, three, four, five. Right? Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm off doing my own thing at the moment. So, uh, those prices are now changed. Uh, for anyone here, uh, this shop is open. So any farsiders watching right now, let me explain this to you because I've had a lot of questions about how this thing actually works. And the way this actually works is, here's the chest, the the item, the horse item or whatever is going to be what you get. So this left chest is what's going to give you this iron horse armor. This right one is going to give you whatever has the payment. So the dime, in this case, I'm at diamonds right now. Whatever has the diamond is where you put your payment. So if we look at the sign, I'm saying you purchase the horse armor on the left, and then your payment goes in this chest on the right. So this is now two diamonds, this is three diamonds, and this is four diamonds. So all you do is you stick, let's, I don't have the diamonds, but you stick in two diamonds into this chest, or any increment of two, and it will give you that many horse armor. So if you put in two diamonds, it will give you one horse armor. If you put in four diamonds, it will give you two horse armor. Make sense? Yes. Yes. And I made it foolproof, so no one... I, I didn't think anyone would screw this up. And still did. <laughs> you can put in however many you want, and it will give you... You don't have to put in two and then wait, and then put in two and wait. You can put in six, and three will come out. I designed the system like that to, to handle that. And uh, so, um, another thing we got to do real quick is... if we Annabelle's over there killing cows. Um... Another thing we got to do real quick is I saw in Zangief's video, we go up here. I saw in Zangief's video that they decided to light up, light up this because obvious reasons mobs were spawning on it. But I don't want that. Uh, I don't like torches, so we're gonna get rid of, we're gonna get rid of some of these and put glowstone in places, just kind of symmetrically. Put it right there, and then we'll put it at the back here. You know what? We'll hide it, because we can hide it right there. Um, could I hide... Could I hide that? I think that's... Oh, that is hideable. Sweet. So we'll hide the glowstone there. That will get rid of that and that. Um, mobs are spawning on here, so I understand the reason why they had to do it. Um, what else? Did you notice Vodka King's new house looks like it has a donut on it? A donut where? Yeah, in the front of his house. It looks like a donut. It's like... Oh. It's like a donut. It hmm. does. No, I did can. not notice that. Oh, yeah, this one. It's. I think it's. It's supposed to be a sprocket. If you look, What's if you look at it from the side, you can see like a chain coming around. A middle of a sprocket, like a wheel sprocket. Oh. And it's supposed to be a chain sort of sprocket. Is what it looks like. It looks like a donut to me. <laughs> it looks like a donut. <laughs> it looks um, delicious. So if we go F three, let's just take out these torches and then I'll place play stuff um so what we're gonna do today 
got a couple things. I'm going to end the episode with showing you guys the witch farm. Got it up and going, and look at all that glowstone I already got. Um, but I think Yurit wants to go find some villagers. The villager zombies, because the we're in the snapshot, if you haven't noticed. Yes, we are in the and snapshot, yep. So, villagers got a bit of a revamp, and I want to <laughs> kind of get the new villagers right away, because there's a awesome new trades. You can get, get emeralds for zombie, or not zombie flesh, rotten flesh. Oh, yeah, you can, can't you? Yeah, and you can also, if you find a right one, you can get also emeralds for mob drops, so bones, arrows, and I think... Yeah, also uh, ender pearls. It's like four ender pearls for an emerald. It's like, ooh. So I just need to find a villager. Oh, yeah, I totally forgot. I remember, uh, yes, I remember. Dude, that is awesome. You are totally right. We need to find some villagers then. Okay, so this ASAP. is all. ASAP, <laughs> get on the yeah. top of this money train. So here we go. Is there any seven? Seven, seven, seven? Nope. Yeah, she's going to join. We're all good on seven lightings up here, dude. Ooh, Wait. not right here. There's a seven right there. How is there a seven right there on this side? But it's not seven on this side. Oh, it is seven on this side. So we'll put a glowstone. Same thing right here in the middle. Maybe I'll just put one at the top of each level. And also, talking about villagers again, I was like, in an entire night in the village, there's one villager left. All the ones are deceased or turned into zombies. And not one zombie villager spawned, so I'm kind of worried. Yeah, in our village over there. Yeah. Yeah. So there's only one left. I just need one. I gotta use my precious gold to convert them. Oh, oh that's funny. tragedy. I got gold for you if you want it. Well, I, I got tons of gold. I just don't want to use it. I got like half a stack of blocks. Oh, then stop being so stingy. Look at this guy, stingy on his money. Jeez. It's my money. I have, I have, and I have like goals for my goal. You know? I want to make a house. <laughs> I have an end goal. I want to retire someday. <laughs> exactly. I don't want to be poor forever. Oh man, I'm lagging. I'm getting like 20 frames. I'm getting, I'm getting a little bit of spikes here and there too. So there we go. That should be all symmetric. Should be able to take all these torches off now. And uh, so we'll come back once we start doing some villager stuff and getting, uh, getting us some villagers. And we're back. And we got one. Woo! We? <laughs> he caught it by himself without me. I'm sorry. I should kill it just for that reason. No, don't do it. Gosh, again, now we, now we got mobs coming after us. Look at this guy. He's only gunpowder. Look at this guy. He wants, he wants some TNT. I should just get some TNT and then we okay. gather a bunch of mobs in water and just kill them. Okay. Is he dead yet? Oh, I? That's what I should do. How cool would that be? Make a mob system and then have TNT fire into it from a TNT cannon. Yeah. Okay. The guy's changing. Oh, you just did it. Yep, I did it. Did you throw everything on it? Did you throw the potion on him too? Yep. Okay, cool. Now I'm just going to make sure he stays safe. I don't know nice. if you guys can see this, but if we look over here, my frames dropped to 30 thanks to Kniva. Uh, I don't know what it is about his building. His building, like, we, we think he has a, since he has a bunch of item frames and items in those item frames, uh, I, we're thinking that it's causing the frame rate to drop. I'm still getting 30, so it looks fine in the recording. But I, I go down to like twenty though. You go down to like twenty. I go down to thirty when I do it. When I see it, I'm I'm looking over here and I'm getting ninety to a hundred. I look back there and it's forty, thirty, eight. <laughs> Come on, villager! Look at him shake. He's just like, Ugh, you Take gave me something bad. <laughs> oh, where'd Annabelle go? I don't know. She's like over there, like doing stuff. I don't see her though. Ah, uh, Enderman. Yurt said something interesting happened with Enderman, too. Yeah, okay, I'll, in this see, snapshot. I'll see. I'll see if you do it again. I'll look at him. Oh. Can you see him? Yeah. Did he come to you? Oh, there you go. Where did he go? Teleported somewhere. He, like, walked into the water and wouldn't teleport away, and he just took so much damage from it. He wasn't acting his normal self. He wasn't he acting his scared self. Yeah. So, yeah, that's that's something interesting. Where'd he go? Is that oh. there? Oh, look at all these guys coming after me. Watch out, there's a... Uh... Okay. I hope it explodes. Two of Come them. Here. Ow! You have like a knockback on his egg or what? Oh Dude, look, yeah, look, look, it's happening again. What? Oh, uh, the Enderman just still oh. stays in... Oh, well, he's I saw him, now. I saw him. Yeah, he was just sitting there in that water. And then just kept teleporting back into the water. Oh, that's weird. They stay a lot longer for some reason in this Oh, path. there's a witch. There's a witch. Hurry up! Hurry up. How long does it take you? Five minutes? I don't know, between, yeah. 
around five minutes. Hey, you're it. Woo! Hey, you're it. Yay, got an enderpearl. Woo! You're it. Oh, what? Come here real quick. Uh -huh. Oh, no, 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 no. Got a little bit of present for ya! I got, I got, I got plenty of my own. I figured I'd give you one. I have lots of those <laughs> That's guys. right. Have your own farm. <laughs> Teamwork for the win. I'm just using my pick for this. This is terrible. Oh shoot! That wasn't me. And no big deal. That wasn't me. We got a lot of creeper holes around here, don't we? Yeah. Got a few. I need to build a squid farm too. Gosh, Ooh. I have so many things I want to build. Got to build my iron golem farm. I need my iron back. I have, a, I have a cool idea though. Something I'm thinking about doing is, is I don't know. Part of me wants to build like a, a pig, zombie pig, a gold farm, but don't use it for an XP grinder. Um, but rather use it for, um, uh, shoot, uh, putting them into a room with iron golems and then iron golems just kill them. I think that'd be fun to sit there and watch that. And fight, ding ding, Goldmans yep. every time. And then also, I, I think it'd be cool, like, to do it where I can just disable, enable or disable a portal, so it will either spawn into like a area where I can kill them, mm. you know, with a potion, or into an area where there's, uh, what you call it? Oh, there. Oh. Hey, what's up? That's what's the trace. Got string. Yeah, now, you can now get string. Dang it. Or you can get emeralds from string. It's awesome. Can you? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. 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 And and I have a spider spawner. Do you? Yeah, yeah we do. Yeah, yeah it's we, right should, we should totally set up a, right a crusher for that. I haven't done that yet. Mm, no. No? No. Okay, well, let's, let me just block him in. No, don't block him in. Not at spawn. Why not? Well, well, just until it turns day. Well, it's almost day anyways. But then we then where are you going to put him? Uh, I think I'll, I'll build a building over by the village and just have... The breeder over there. Hmm. For now, just make a nice little building. Hmm. At spawn. And at the village. It's a bit, a bit, a little bit away from spawn. What's up, spider? Oh. I got some string. Yay! We'll, we'll put the that nothing in shops <laughs> has a spider in yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. Well, I put, a, I put, I put some torches in there now. Yeah. Hey, hey. So we're going to uh, figure out something else to do. This yeah. is going to be a me and Yurt episode of doing something. He's got arrows in his shoulder. I do? Yep. I do. Mm -hmm. Yep, right in your back, dude. Right in your back. Hopefully. Don't take it for granted. Don't take it for granted. Cherish it while it's there. Just cherish <laughs> yeah, it. It'll be spawned soon. Just gotta cherish. love it. Woo! So we're here. Like I told you guys, we're going to show you guys the witch farm today. Um, So we're back here at the witch farm, and I got to show you guys something. We got the new slime blocks. I got to. I I decided this is gonna be my way. I'm gonna I'm gonna build it all the way up through the surface of the of here, and I'm gonna just drop down to get down here. But for right now, we got the stair to get down here. We have the staircase that comes from the surface. But I'm gonna then just do this as my way of transporting down here. Boo! <laughs> Gosh, that oh, is so cool. Awesome. That's so cool. So then that's gonna be our way down. So if we come here, look. Here is the glowstone. Um, like I said, we got a lot of glowstone already that I made into blocks. Then we got a lot of redstone, a lot of bottles, a lot of sugar, a lot of spider eyes, a whole bunch of sticks, and then a bunch of gunpowder. Um, we're going to be doing a deal with Kaniva. I'm going to be doing a deal with Kaniva on, uh, potion supplies, because he has that potion shop. So, uh, that will be a later episode, though. We're going to make a little deal. I already gave him a sample. You know, I had to make, he had, I had to prove to him that my sample was worthy of his, uh, or my product was worthy of his potion shop. So, uh, he already got a little bit of a sample, you know, going on that. So, gosh, these things are so cool. They're awesome. Boing! Boing, 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 boing. Did you know they're slower than, they're slower than, uh, um, uh, so, uh, slow sand. Yeah. yeah. Soul sand, yep. I wonder if they're. I wonder if they're even slower if you have ice under them. Maybe. That'd be interesting. If awesome. I can just, I just like jump over it. <laughs> if you'd speed up or slow down. Um, and then to show you guys this how this works. I was told by Sneeg, a uh, far side member, that Etho kind of has a design like this for a, a spider farm or something. Yeah. Um, he didn't want. He didn't want to have a like for my. He just wanted to have it with the 
trip wires, so it didn't go all the time. But oh. going all the time doesn't really make a big difference. Okay. Well, but, yeah. keep going. Or, or do you also have it with the? Uh... Nope, I don't have any trip wires. The no. way I have this working is um, these these rails are always on. Everything's always on. Um, and what ends up happening? How does this go? Okay, this is how it goes. This, this redstone torch right here is powering these last four rails is what ends up happening. I have a redstone block down here which powers the first nine and then after the or first eight or nine and then these last four are powered by this redstone torch. And what ends up happening is whenever that rail cart gets here, we'll wait for it. When that rail cart gets here, it starts uh, dispensing items into the item hopper which yeah. turns off this redstone torch which then turns off these and lets it sit here and dispense. So it'll dispense those and then once it stops dispensing items into the item hopper it will turn this redstone torch back on, which turns on this powered rail, which will send the cart off again. There you go. That's the system. So this is the entire witch farm. Um, I already showed you guys the top. So uh, we came here to get rails because we want to move that that villager that we just captured. So I don't know where he's going. Have you? Where you oh yeah, I forgot the portal. Thing. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, so yeah, we will see you guys back at spawn. So what are Hello. you doing? I'm building a villager breeder. This is his house. Quote unquote house. <laughs> it's not called a house. It's not done yet. Why is he done? <laughs> ah. Well, he got some villagers and he's trying to get them to breed. I'm not doing nothing. See. And I need some more wood. Yeah. What, for the villagers? No. <laughs> see what I did there? See what I did oh. <laughs> I get it. Slow clap. Ah. <laughs> oh, that was a terrible joke. That was a great joke. It's a great joke. Um, but I got 30 levels. I want to go enchant something. With the new system? Yeah, with that new system. Uh, by the way, I have some lapis for sale at my shop. Oh, do you? I have a bunch of lapis at my house. Because I, I have to go get diamonds anyways. Because I want to make a sword. I want to make a sword. I want to make a book. And I want to make a pickaxe. And, oh! You got baby? No, I looked at him. He got stage fright. You got a little bit of stage fright going on. Hey, there you, you go. You the cat in the background or no? Your cat? Yeah, there's a cat in the background just meowing. No, I don't hear it. Okay, good. Do you hear it? What? Do you hear it? Um, well, it's up it. now, but... <laughs> no, I didn't hear it. Very good. <laughs> How many levels you got? I got 21. Getting close. Okay, I should kill you. Cause, cause that, so I... <laughs> no! <laughs> might want to enchant something first. Oh, then dang it. Working. Up. Dang it! I'm in. I'm out. We're good. Okay, oh, so man, it's turning night again. So yeah, he's doing this. Why? Cause he wants to get some villagers. If you remember from what I just said, he wants yeah. to get some villagers because the new trading system. This is an old villager, as you guys can see. It says just villager, and it has the old cooked fish. Or not the old cooked fish, but it has only one trade. Is what I meant. You could, yeah. What? Are so they, that's why breeding. I think. Are they like oh leg? Um, so yeah, he's making, he's breeding them to, to get some more villagers with the new trade. So if we look at this one, if you didn't know about villager trading, if you click on them, they'll automatically get two trades. You can do one or the other. And then if you do one of them, it'll give you two more from what we've experienced with this guy. We gave him 20 string, and he ended up giving us a bow option, and then the gravel option. So, uh, hi, how you doing? They're nodding to me, they're looking at me. We are your, we come in peace, we are your... King, we obey you. Thank you. These villagers are mine. They obey me. If you say so. Yep. Are you looking at the wood? What the are you wood. doing over there? Me? Yeah. My uh, axe ran out, and I'm just oh. using the wood I got to make some torches to light up this area quickly before zombies start ah. attracting them and getting more leg on the darn server. Yep. So we uh we told him that if he wants to have them here at spawn, he has to uh light up this whole area so that they don't start tracking because we realized that we were getting some of the leg that we talked about earlier from these zombies tracking a villager that was over there. Um, it seemed like whenever we killed them, they would st stop. See, it gets like a little bit of, at least it feels like it does. Not for sure, but it feels like it does. I don't think I'm reaching them. So, uh... <laughs> yeah, jump down, party! Woo! Jump down, party with the zombies! Woo! Right? Yeah. So what are you doing? Lighten up. He's lighting up. So he's going to sit here and light up, and I'm going to watch him. 
Yeah, why not? And then we're going to finish the episode off with uh, us doing a little bit of enchanting with the new enchanting system. Right? Yeah, why not? If why I not? get enough levels. Yep, we'll get to the levels. <laughs> we'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey, everybody, we're back. I'm almost at level 30. we get this stuff out the furnaces. And that's not going to even get close enough. Not even. Really? Not even close. Nope. Not even close. You get 29? I'll get 29. Oh, yeah. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, just got to 29. Woo! Barely to 29, huh? Yeah, levels are so hard to get now. Wow. Ridiculous. What's it say? Sell your stuff here? Sell, I sell stuff and take your gold. Yeah. How nice of you. <laughs> I know. So I think you have a few levels to enchant. Yes, one. I have levels to enchant. Let's go see what I can get. Um, it's not. Where are you going? Where isn't where? It's not over there. Where's, oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's over here. <laughs> I couldn't remember. I was like, oh, I thought it was. A... People be changing stuff. It ain't my fault. It ain't my fault, dude. All right, let's get rid of all these torches. What? The torches. All right, let's see what I get. If we put in a book, it says here, ooh, I'll get an infinity one and something else. So I got a power one, an unbreaking two, and an infinity one on the book. Let's see what I get on the diamond pick. Ooh, I get an efficiency four. Would be the best thing for the pick. How about the sword? The sword you're looking at, ooh, a knockback two or a looting one or a knockback one. Whoa. So I think... Efficiency 4 or Infinity 1. I'd like an Infinity on my bowl, to be honest with you. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to go with 3 levels. So for those of you guys that don't know, um, each different thing that you can enchant, you can get a different sort of enchantment. And it tells you one of the enchants you'll get on it. So this one, my pickaxe will get at least Efficiency 4 if I was to get that. The book will get at least an Infinity 1 on if I was to sacrifice 3 Lapis. If I were to sacrifice two lapis, it would take, uh, I'm breaking, t give me at least an breaking two, and then same here with power one. So, but like I said, I want the infinity, so we're gonna put in three lapis. It's gonna take those three lapis to enchant it, but it also only took three levels instead of all 30 this time. So I go, ooh, a power four infinity! Yes! Nice! So, that is good. Um, I wanna see what I can possibly get. Uh, looting three. Oh, sweet! My sword can get looting three as one of his enchantments. Ah, oh, nice. So I, I think also now that I enchanted something, all my enchants will reset. So if we go here and look, I had efficiency four on my pick. Well, you only have you put the torches back down, so it only has five levels. Oh yeah, true, true. Put that, put it back, put it back. Get out, get out of here. Get out of here. All right. So if we put this back in here, thirty. Okay, efficiency four again. And this was a knockback too. Okay, maybe it doesn't change if you. It should change. It's like a universal thing. You could have just gotten two things in a row. That's Maybe they change that. Maybe the they're different. Maybe. Snapshot. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe. Let's see what my. Let's see what I get for my next book. Next book is efficiency four. So that definitely changed. Um, obviously. But yeah, I think they change every time you do an enchant. So my sword should have a different enchant. I think I just got unlucky with this knockback two, to where you know what the it has an unbreaking three for my lower level enchant, on my sword. So that would actually be good to do. My lower level enchant on that is efficiency 3. I don't want that. And my book is efficiency 3 or efficiency 4. So actually, I want an unbreaking on my sword. So I'm going to go ahead. And this, as you can see, it, I need I need 19 levels to do this enchant. But it will only take 2 away. So I'm at 29. It will take these 2 lapis, but it will only take 2 levels. So now I'm at 27. Ah, son of a donkey. Boo. I got, get? I'm breaking 3. Fire aspect. And can you take a guess what the last one is? Bane of Arthropods. Yes, Bane of Arthropods. Yeah, oh my gosh. Well, we do have a spider spawner. <sighs> you can donate it. I can donate it. Yay. <laughs> Yay. But anyways, guys, that's going to go ahead and conclude this episode on the Far Side server today. Um, if you're not subscribed to Yurt, go check him out. He's kind of... <laughs> I'm the least amount of subscribers on the far side server. I'm so lonely. I was gonna say he's lonely over there. Uh, but um, go check him out if you're if you're not subscribed to him. He's a funny guy. He does a lot of cool stuff. Uh, he tries to compete with me with redstone. Um, <laughs> if, <laughs> they try. He tries. He tries. He does. There's one project that Anna wanted me to do, and he rushed over there and did it for her. 
I already said I was going to do it, but uh -huh. then she got and I was like, oh, whatever, I'll just quickly rush over there before uh -huh. someone else takes my, uh -huh. takes my spot. Yeah. yeah, that's what he says. That's what he says. I say, yeah. But anyways, uh, thank you guys for watching. You want you got anything you want to close with? Yeah, uh, other than um, thanks for watching, and see you guys next time. All right, thanks for watching. Dream big. <laughs>